So the Madden Mon community made a Ultimate Legend roster. Shout out to the Madden Mon community as always. Absolute legendary community. Shout out to... I don't know his actual name. Because every time you click on a profile on Madden Mon community, it always just shows you like one letter of the name so this guy's name is s but there's a whole name to that again i can't actually see his name but shout out to him because he posted this mod so first off we have as you can see right here the actual ultimate legends now listen okay shout out to him for this right because this is awesome but i gotta give some flack and some setback here because he added to the game Carson Palmer, right? He gave us Boomer Sison for the Bengals and Carson Palmer. No big deal, right? Love both those guys. He made Carson Palmer a 66 overall, and I'm going to start beefing with him now. Okay, now you cross the line, man. 66 overall for Carson Palmer? Like, bro, Carson Palmer was amazing. And then he left us and went to the Arizona, and he was still amazing with Arizona. It took him to the playoffs. Went for the Carolina Panthers in 2015. Guy would have been an absolute, even more of a superstar. But as you can see, there's a lot of 99 overall. So I, that's the point. As I go down here, I can literally scroll as fast as I want, and I'm not going to be getting through all the 99s anytime soon. I mean, the whole entire league is... Almost 99s, but it's not. So, like, for example, the Bears right here, they have a lot of 99s, and then they have the rest of their cards. But, listen, this is beef right here. This is beef, okay? <sighs> James Brook, Coy Dillon, and Charles Alexander, okay? He gave us Chad Green, Isaac Curtis, Chris Collinsworth, and Carl Pickens, and DJ Hoosh, Manzada, Bob Trumpy, and then Rodney Holman. Willie Anderson, not Munoz? Oh, he put Munoz at right. Munoz was a left tackle. Um, I'm saying he can't play right, but, but what's up with this 46 overall nonsense? All right, some of these cards he just made, like, or some of these players he made, like, 20 overalls. Uh, that is interesting. So, you know what? Let's just get right into a game. Let's just see how this looks, and... That's, you know, most of these videos I go into, I have no actual idea on how they're going to go, right? Kind of just go into them, booty butthole naked, and we just see how it ends up turning out. So I'm going to go random team three times, okay? One. Two. Three. Okay, 49ers. One. Two. Three. Raiders. Can we unlock some, like... You know, hidden gems, uniforms. Because if we're going to do Ultimate Legends, man. Yeah, let's go to the 75th Anniversary Unis over here. And over here. Um, we'll do AFL Anniversary Away Unis. So we got the 75th Anniversary Unis over here. Actually, wait, does it not set it? Oh, never mind. It won't, it won't save it. You can only choose yours for your own team. Unless, wait, did it save that? No, wait, why is it not... Oh, wait, do I have to click A? Bro, I was clicking B. Or maybe not? I don't know. Whatever, this game is broken. Let's just get into this. Let's see how this looks. I don't think there's anything custom. Actually, hold up. Does he have all the 32 stadiums unlocked? Or all the stadiums in general unlocked? Because can you play... Maybe, maybe not. Okay, he doesn't. Oh, see, that's that's that that's a miss here. If he had all the stadiums unlocked, there is a Hall of Fame stadium you can play in, and that would be really freaking dope. But it looks like he just has the typical stadiums unlocked. All right, I mean, it is what it is at the end of the day. It just would be cool if it was like you know something extreme, like having it like um custom stadium or something but still listen we're getting the legend roster versus legend roster the marcus allen roster here so we got jim pluckett versus joe montana so we got steve young joe montana i'm gonna start steve young 
a lot more mobile. Roger Craig, Frank Gore. Okay. We got T.O. Thankfully, we've got a roster that's actually not bad. <laughs> I don't know, I'm going to say not bad, but like, you know. Has a lot of 99s on it. Okay, so the line looks like it's going to be good for the most part. Um, okay. Yeah, that, that strong safety position is really hurting. Oh, they got Jack Tatum on the other side. All right, so we got Jim Puck Pluckett. We got Bo Jackson, Marcus Allen, and uh, 66 overall. Fullback is Marcus Allen. You know what I really wish they would have put on here? Is Marcel Reese. Marcel Reese, I feel like, would have been so good. Obviously, yes, Randy Moss was on this team, but he wasn't the guy uh, on this team when it comes to that. Fred Belitnikoff is on this team. Cliff Branch, okay. Wait, what is... Oh, Fred's only an 86? I feel like that's a missed opportunity. I feel like he should be higher overall. I'm not here to criticize this roster. It's amazing. I'm just... You know, listen, bro. Bro, you're going to put an Ultimate Legend roster together. You automatically know I'm going to go out here and give my thoughts and opinion. Wait, what's going on here? Okay, that that circle looks very small for some reason. Am I bugging or did that circle look really small? All right, let me just make sure there's nothing like hidden here. The only thing hidden is my passing game. All right. I think everything is just normal man. I, I think that was just weird because it was a kickoff. Let's just see how this game goes. Let's see how this game plays out here. 7-3, 14-3. Yeah, I don't know if the all-time... Oh, okay, never mind. They made a little bit of comeback, the all-time Raiders here. Guess it's not really the all-time Raiders, but somewhat the all-time Raiders. All right, 27 to 30. Overtime. We go to double overtime, and the Raiders win in the end. Okay, shout out to the Raiders there. That was actually a really good back and forth game. 335 yards, three touchdowns, 305 yards, one touchdown. Bo Jackson had a game. Marcus Allen had a fantastic game. A lot of rushing for the um, Raiders. Niners, Roger Craig had a good game. Uh, T.O. freaking went off this game. Nice to see that. Three and a half sacks with Howie Long, Leo, okay, P. Willie. Oh, man, some of these names. Seeing some of these names again is absolutely beautiful. Guys, tell me down below your thoughts and opinions. I will give them, you know, give this guy a lot of credit, man. This is actually really dope. Again, sometimes it's nice to see some of these older guys and some older players, you know. You have... Growing up, I, I had a lot of these like crazy great Hall of Fame players I wasn't able to see. I mean, some of them I were, obviously, Adrian Peterson, you know, Sean Alexander, Randy Moss, but not all the players. Roger Craig was before my time, but I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.